standing up. Didn't mean to be standing up. Should we crouch? Yet? Whoa! Shit! No, this isn't good. It's coming from this direction. What was I just saying about meeting people in the strangest of places? This isn't even a big town I'm heading towards, it's tiny. it can't hear anything now doesn't mean much though just means you could have killed all the zombies sounded like it was coming from over there to me not shooting anymore though Is that just because you can't see me anymore? The other bad thing is as well, I mean I love playing my games in as like high quality as possible. But you do get people who can even run the game just as good as me if not better, who put all the visual settings down to low just so the foliage and the grass and the bushes don't spawn as much so that they can see you easier to kill you no I don't think that's very sporting but you know what can you do that's how some people like to play just to give them the best chance possible of being the killer rather than the killie I think it came from that way, you know. There's not much tree cover up there. messages popping up there. I'll probably just check those the next time I need to check them out. Oh, right. Right. What we've got here? The ruined church. Hit the deck. Right. Two seconds, guys. I'm going to go and check the map. Try and double check my location. I'll be back soon. Okay. So, I shouldn't have followed the dirt road. I should have crossed straight over and kept going north. And then followed the main road. That takes us away from the gunshots, which is a good thing, obviously. But it does mean I have to cross an open field, which ain't such a good thing. And I think I was right, you know, I think that deer hut. I think it's either in those clump of trees, or it's just up here somewhere. You'll probably see the zombies that spawn around it before you see the deer hut itself. It's normally how it works. So I'm just backtracking on myself a little bit. Just to see if I can see it. Always on the lookout for better weapons, more ammunition. Oh shit. There's a little cabin or something there. Which means there could be zombies nearby, I should be careful. Right, 
there's the road. Just there, look. Rabbit in the middle of the road, can he? Right, I see, I'm not gonna bother shooting it. It's not worth the bullet for the amount of meat it gives us. Cross this road quickly. Take a look down the hill, there's the deer hut. I knew there was one around here. Just outside of Gug Lovell, on the main road. Obviously, I thought I was on the main road before. I was on the dirt road. But we're back on track now. There's a policeman zombie hopping away. And a military zombie slowly walking away. Now, you normally get three zombies around deer huts. But don't get us wrong, I have seen up to 10, 11, 12 zombies around a deer hut. I've also gotten to a deer hut before and then zombies have spawned like literally about 5 metres away from us. Obviously, you know, we all know it's an alpha, alpha and that there is things like this to be expected. So I'm not complaining. Well I am, but you know what I mean. Something I'll happily live with at the moment. As far as I'm concerned, he can take as much time as he wants. Let's quickly check up here. Oh, yep. Yeah. We've got bandages there. We've got ACP and Makarov by the looks of it. I mean, it's worth checking, I suppose, because, you know, that could be a map or anything. But no, it is Makarov. Of course it is. Just want to get back down here and away with all these Zeds coming knocking. I'm not too far away from the town now either. Straight up that road there. There we go, you can see the start of it, look. There's quite a lot of open ground between here and there. I keep downhill a little bit. I'm s I am crouched, that's alright then. Hopefully I'll be a little bit harder to see for anybody who's to me left. Anybody to me right, well I'm just fucked basically. But the idea is, do a quick snoop around here, see if we can get into some enterable buildings, do a last bit of looting, then turn our attention north, to start, heat, to start uh, heading towards the meter point with Mesh and the rest of the team. And zombies ahead. I think if I'm good enough, I can just zoom around here. 
Well, I know I'm good enough, but you know what I'm saying. I've went and said it now, haven't I? Say something stupid like that, and you're bound to get shot. Or you're bound to aggro zombies. Yeah, looks like I'm around doors. Don't like that, and he has zombies straight ahead of us. But I've got to go up a hill. You know for a fact, as soon as I get to the top of that hill, there's a zombie in your face. small town this one. It's not that noble building is it? No. Oh shit. Please tell me that was a, a hopping zombie. Yep it is. What the hell? Did he just run and fall down? What on earth's going on? I don't like it. Get me out of here. I'm sure that zombie glitched. I'm sure he started running and he fell down. What the hell? Yeah, that's another zombie, that's alright. I don't like this town. It doesn't look like there's anything here, basically. I think there's one lootable building up there. In fact, no. I don't think it is lootable, actually. And if that's all there is... It's a bit shit. But it just means I'll have to leave in a hurry. And carry, with, carry on with a plan of heading north. No, not enterable. Back this way then. Right, so I'm gonna go down here, I'm gonna cross the road. Oh, what? You are joking me. When on earth did I aggro him? Go away. Right, my only chance now. Sprinting into these woods. That's never a building, is it? Right. I might aggro more zombies. But I think... My option is... Ah, that's too loud. Sprint to that barn. Get indoors. Take on these bad boys with the Enfield. Oh, what server are we starting in two minutes? Well, to be honest, I suppose that ties in with when I'm going to need to stop recording so I can carry on to my unspecified secret location in the unspecified secret server that we will be joining, which is normally a different server every time, to be honest, um, to meet up with the gang. My water's just started flashing. I'm going to start dying of thirst soon. Maybe I'll be able to survive until the server restarts and kicks us off. I want to get as high up here as possible for when that does happen so I don't get respawned in the middle of a town when I come back in. Never have a good thing. We've got three more Zeds there. I think, yeah. Get to this barn as quickly as possible. You can see everybody's disconnecting there now, they know the server's going to be start. Oh, my food and my drinks now flashing. 
but we'll see what happens. If we get kicked, this is the end of the single player lone wolf experience. And the next time you see us, we'll be with the rest of the gang. There's nothing useful in here. Yeah, the end field is very loud. But it is a one shot. That went quite well actually. I'd already aggroed all the zombies around us. So there wasn't too many to shoot. There's no more in the way I don't think. I'm now gonna lie down in this corner. And log out since the server has been starting. Thanks for watching guys. Like I say the next time you see us. I'll be back with all the boys in the team. Trying to do it hardcore style. Like we try to do, like we like to do, looting all the towns that we can, being as active as possible, taking some risks, killing some Zeds. There we go, session lost. Thanks a lot guys, see you next time.